Welcome to a video tutorial from George Mason University Libraries. In this tutorial, we'll learn how to find United States government publications. U.S. government publications are valuable primary sources of information on a variety of topics. As a federal selective depository library, Mason Libraries has been receiving 60% of all federal publications since 1960. The U.S. government documents collection contains recent and historical documents from the executive, legislative, and judicial branches of government. Publications include the United States Code, Presidential Papers, Supreme Court Opinions, Agency Research and Regulatory Reports, Congressional Reports and Hearings, Data Resources, Topographic Maps, and other resources. The collection is located in Fenwick Library, First Floor, Wing C. It includes items in print, electronic, and microfiche formats, as well as items on CD and DVD. To find materials published after 1960, use the Mason Online Catalog. To find these materials in the library, you'll need the call number first. Here are a few tips. You can try searching by author. Now, the author of federal publications is the issuing agency, department, or committee. Use United States at the beginning and then the name of the issuing agency. To search by author, go to the library homepage. In the drop-down menu, select Browse Author. And in the search box, type in United States Bureau of the Census. Click Search and you see these results for the Census Bureau will appear. Now you can also try variations of your search term. For example, instead of typing in United States Bureau of the Census, type in United States Census Bureau. Click Submit, and that search will provide these results. Now you see no results are listed for United States Census Bureau of the, but you can click on the See Also button to the left of these results, for suggested alternates. This method will usually take you to the right place. When searching for documents published by specific departments, remember that the word department usually needs to be abbreviated to DEPT period. So for example, if you search for United States Department of Energy and spell out the word department, you won't find what you're looking for. But if you abbreviate the word department, to DEPT, you should be able to find what you're looking for. You can also extend the author search if you know a specific office within the agency that you're looking for. So for example, you can type in United States Energy Information Administration, period, Office of Energy Data. and that search will take you directly to the results for that office. To search for congressional materials, enter United States Congress, either House or Senate, and the committee that you're looking for. For example, United States Congress, Senate Committee on Commerce. You can also search for specific subcommittees. For example, United States Congress, Senate Committee on Commerce, period, Aviation Subcommittee. You can also limit your search to items that are only contained in the Fenwick Library Government Documents Collection. To do this, simply go to the library homepage, click on the link for catalog. Now on the right, find the Set Limits button and under Location, select Fenwick Documents. And click Set Limits. And now you see the purple text says, Search Limits are in effect. Now the catalog will only search for items in Fenwick Library Government Documents. Another option is to search by keyword. In the drop-down menu, simply select any word anywhere and try interstate and highways. You can also search by exact call number or exact title of a particular document if you've already acquired this information from another source. Government documents have their own special system of call numbers known as the Superintendent of Documents or SUDOCS system.
The SUDOC system is the 90-year-old classification system the U.S. government uses to identify and catalog government publications. You can visit the Government Printing Office website for more information about it, or you can visit the Mason Library Government Documents Info Guide at infoguides.gmu.edu slash usgovt. An example of a SUDOX number is seen here. Remember the difference between a SUDOX number and a regular Library of Congress call number is the colon in the middle. To do a call number search, simply select that item from the drop-down menu and plug in the call number. In this case, we'll use S space 1.2 colon C space 33 slash 5. Hitting Submit will take you right to the item that's been assigned that call number. Lastly, we can search by subject. To do this, we have to once again limit our search to the Fenwick Library Government Documents section. So click Catalog, find the Set Limits button on the right, select Fenwick Documents as location, and hit Set Limits. Make sure Subject Heading is checked, and now put in whatever subject you're looking for. In this case, we'll use Health Insurance. And here we have our subject listing for Health Insurance. It can be difficult to know which subject heading to search for. Different topics can have many different subject headings. To find the right subject heading, simply do a keyword search first. That way you can find a specific item that's somewhat related to your search topic and find out what subject categories that item fits into. For example, search for health insurance in any word, anywhere. This search will bring up a pretty long list of documents. Find one that seems like it might be related to what you're looking for and click on that document record. Lastly, take a look at the listing of subject headings that this item fits into. You can then do a search for these subject headings. Many items are also available electronically. To limit your search for electronic items, go to the library homepage and select Catalog. Find the Set Limits button on the right. Again, select Fenwick Documents as your location. And now under Medium, select Electronic Resources. Click Set Limits. And now you will only search for government documents in electronic format. For example, select Insurance. And here you see a list of electronic resources dealing with insurance from the federal government. Click on the first item and scroll down until you see the line for Links. You can click on this item and the document itself will appear. There are a few other search tools to be aware of. If you wish to perform a comprehensive search of government publications that our library does not hold, you should use the Catalog of Government Publications, which is the online search tool for the U.S. Government Printing Office. You can access this tool through Mason Library's website. On the library's homepage, simply click Databases and then select C and scroll down until you've found Catalog of U.S. Government Publications. You can also access this search tool by browsing to the URL catalog.gpo.gov. This catalog contains all federal documents published after 1976, which is the year that federal records became available in electronic form. Once you've found the documents that you need, obtain their SUDOC call numbers and ask library staff to help you locate those documents. Titles published prior to 1976 can be located through a print index called the Monthly Catalog of U.S. Government Publications, nicknamed the Red Book, which has been published since 1876. This index is available in the government documents shelves under call number GP 3.8. Another useful resource for finding historical government documents is WorldCat. To access the WorldCat database, go to the library's homepage, select Databases, and click W for WorldCat and scroll down until you find it. This database contains several million documents from around the world, some as early as the 12th century. Once you've found the citation for a book or document that you need, ask a librarian for help locating that document. There are several other key resources available to the Mason community. One of these is GPO Access, the online portal for the Government Printing Office. However, all of the material through this site is being migrated to FDSIS, which is the GPO's new portal. Other resources include USA.gov, the Thomas Database from the Library of Congress, 
LexisNexis Congressional, Hein Online, and many others. This tutorial has provided just a brief overview of government documents and resources at Fenwick Library. For more information about these resources, visit the U.S. Government Documents Info Guide at infoguides.gmu.edu slash usgovt or ask a librarian.